Hello everyone. Welcome again. Today I will explain you about scope of variable in Python. So in my previous session I have already covered about keyboard and default argument and Python function. But scope of variable is a very important concept when we are using function. So if you don't know about the function, please watch my previous session. Or I will mention the URL in my description there, so you can refer it from here. So first of all, let's see the agenda of uh, this session. I will explain you about scope of variable, what is local and global variable, and by using one example, I will show you how we can use it in real life program. So if you are new to this channel, consider subscribing and pressing bell icon. For more updates, let's start with scope of variable in Python. So, whenever we are talking about variable, all variables in a program may not be accessible in all location or all functions. That is totally dependent on the declaration of variable where we have declared and where we are not using. The scope of variable determines. the portion of the program where we can access a particular identifier because of that python has characterized as similar as other programming language python is also categorized scope of variable in two parts first is global variable and second is local variables so whenever we are calling as a global variable which is declared at the start or outside of the function and which is used in each and every functions if you are working in a five function it is declared on top of that in main function and that function is used in every places so it is not required to every time declare once we will declare we can use it at any point of time but local variable is you can say that private to any function which we can use it throughout the function only it is not allowed to use outside the function so let's see what is the differences between global and local variables so variables that are defined inside the function body have a local scope and those defined outside have a global called as global variables this means that local variables can be accessed only inside the function in which they are declared whereas global variables can be accessed throughout the program body by all functions when we call a function that variables declared inside it are brought into scope so let's see by using one example so i am giving here as a to token The uh, token is uh, some keywords, so let's change the name. Uh, add, addition, addition. Oh, addition is also some keyword, no? or we can use it. Addition equal to zero semicolon. Then we are going to define one function. In that definition of function, we are going to provide as a add var 1 comma var 2 so this is the definition of function and let's call same addition variable inside this function and the scope of that addition is limited to only this function addition equal to var1 plus var2 then semicolon semicolon and then let me print this value print so 
this is inside function then i am using same addition here now you can see all the warnings are resolved let's recall it or return return the addition here sorry semicolon let's start with sum of 20 comma 30 we are giving the value okay let's print outside the function because the scope of function is from here to here and let me copy and paste this complete sentence and I will make a changes here. This is outside function. So outside function will print this value and inside the function will print the total number. Because we have declared here variable 1 and 2, it will sum up the number variable 1 and 2 will provide the final output but this will provide me a global variable or we can see that here is a function global oh. global and here for the differences local so let's run this command and see the result now we can see here this is the inside of function local 50 and outside function which is global. So let me explain you. So whenever we are using the definition of function or we have declared any function inside the function whatever value we have declared is applicable from start to end till here. But when we are using the main function so whatever value we have declared that is addition of value we have declared is applicable globally for other function. So if I am using inside or we can see that the value which is inside the function is having more priority as compared to other outside. So first it will pick the value inside the function then it will means it is overriding the value so this is this way we can compare global variable and local variable so this value we are getting because of the local variable which we have declared addition of variable 1 and variable 2 but here uh, this statement is giving us a zero value because here we have declared global variable so by this way we can differentiate local variable and global variable and use in real life. So let's recap this. Yes, we have started with global variable and local variable. We have understand what is local and global variable. Then I have explained about what is the differences between two and finally by using this program I explain here how we can use it in real life. So this is all about scope of variable in Python. Hope you liked it. If you really enjoyed this video, consider subscribing and pressing bell icon for more updates. Thank you for watching.